Hey y'all, what y'all doing on this blessed Thursday night? Well, I'm about to meet my husband. Um, about to meet my husband. Um, guys, keep us in prayer. Pray for us, you know. We don't live together because we're still working on bringing that all together. Um, I have been married, though, for a year and eight months. So I'm just trusting God, um, looking for a new home, hoping that everything falls through. And um, I'm just, you know, trusting God and, you know, waiting for him to come through with that. But so anyways, me and him are going to a, a church meeting today. I'm excited about that. Um, but I wanted to get on here. I wanted to talk about uh, Mr. LaTruth and Miss LaTruth. Um, so I follow them, actually. You know what I mean? Like, I ran into them on... I ran into them on that platform maybe, like, two years ago. And I, you know, follow their skits and stuff. And, you know, I like them. You know what I mean? I have nothing bad to say. Listen, I'm married and I know marriages go through stuff, ups and downs. Every marriage got big problems or little problems. But regardless, marriage always has problems. Because it's two people that have different backgrounds or maybe even the same, but everything's not all the way healed, and they come together to become one. You know what I mean? He got his hiccups, she got her hiccups. You know what I'm saying? You know, me and my husband, we go through stuff. Like it's listen, and marriage ain't for the weak, and it ain't all fairy tales and candy. That ain't what it is. So if you're gonna get into a marriage thinking it's gonna be fairy tales and candy, listen, that ain't what it is. Just warning you, be ready. Be suited and booted, okay? <laughs> Make sure you got that inner strength from the Lord because it's going to be times that you like, <laughs> who's signing the papers? Who's signing the papers? You or me? <laughs> you know what I mean? So listen. So anyways, as saints, we should lift them up in prayer because y'all know the devil don't like marriage. He will do anything to tear that apart. I feel that as saints, we should always be praying for you know, couples that are, you know, about to head to divorce. You know, we should definitely be praying for them. Um, what I do, like I said, I'm not here to bash them or anything like that. I don't know who's right, who's wrong. They're both accusing each other of stuff. I don't know. I'm not in their marriage. But what I can say is I do have an issue with his responses lately to his fans. Listen. You can't get on the live saying, mind your business. You don't know me and my wife. You know what I mean? Like, you don't know us personally. She don't care about anything that's going on in your lives. If it's not on a social media platform, we don't care. Like, we don't know you in real life. Don't judge me. Don't say I should be doing I should be. Hold on, 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 hold on. We got to eat some humble pie you know what i'm saying and we got to watch our tone and also for her as well because today she was uh responding well she was on the live i think yesterday then she got um so then i just was listening to it today and she was saying like you know to her fans or whoever follows her um i don't care if y'all think i'm lying um i know the truth i know the truth and god knows the truth i don't give a and in the same token, you sit there and say that you've been basically keeping it together for six years, basically putting on a fraud, basically, and covering up for him for six years. To Miss LaTruth and Mr. LaTruth, y'all got to have some patience for all the people that's going through a rough time with y'all and that's been following y'all. People looked up to y'all. Y'all got to have some patience. People are surprised. People are hurt. They're confused. If you're if you portray your relationship as a certain thing and your marriage is a certain thing, then you have a big following and something erupts in that, there's going to be questions, there's going to be comments, there's going to be, you know, I thought y'all was solid. There's going to be, I can't believe she did that, or I can't believe he did that. 
Like, you know this. So, but have some grace, have some patience. Because you've been building the fans up to believe that you guys was rocking a certain way. When come to find out y'all wasn't rocking that way. So, that's all I want to say. I love y'all. If you ever see this, I'm praying for y'all. If y'all split, I know God is going to have something greater for both. Whatever he wants to do. Or either he'll bring it back together. I'm praying for y'all. But please, have some grace and some patience for the people who are that you have led that are now confused. Anyway, guys, I love y'all. Enjoy your name.